Katie Plays Stuff. Hey, I'm Katie, and this is Katie Plays Stuff, where I play stuff for you. So today we're going to get to the next part of Outlast. Last time we played, we did a lot. Pretty much a ton of stuff happened. Um, but luckily, hopefully, we are going to get to meet Father Martin in this part. I really hope so, because we've been chasing him around like this entire time, and I hope that we can catch up with him sooner than later. <laughs> All right, let's get on to the next part. Okay, so here's where we left off. Um, came up those stairs, and now we have another sign that says follow, that says follow the blood. So let's follow the blood. I wonder if we're getting close to the end of the game yet. Uh, let's check over here first. Hopefully there's nobody chasing us just yet. Alright. Ooh. Ooh yeah. That's right. That's right. Gotta shimmy this way. Oh no. I am not ready to get chased again. This game needs to like let you have like a good 15 minutes of just like enjoyment. <laughs> and then chase you. Who's in here? What's the music for? <gasps> I don't think I was supposed to do that. Well, what's that? What the heck was that? So dark down here. Let's try that again. Okay. Uh, let's try not to fall in that again. Who's in here? I don't like how quiet it is. What's this? Excerpt from the diary of Shirley Pierce, Mount Massive Mental Hospital patient. Oh, so maybe we're gonna get to the girls pretty soon. 1952 to 1964. How can I not remember where the cuts are coming from? They hurt so deeply, even days later. Dr. Newhouse tells me that it's my fault. I'm subconsciously resisting the hypnotherapy, but I want so much to get better. I don't know how I could be doing this to myself. Dr. Newhouse says it's another condition of my bedroom-inspired hysteria. Poor Bruce, I make him suffer so. I've tried subtly to ask Mrs. Jackson if she had similar issues with her husband, but she is loath to talk about it. Her husband, too, has found comfort in a younger woman. I know the doctors only mean well, and with the help of the government men who've joined the staff, I am in the very best hands possible. I should just take my pills and sleep, and hope for more pleasant dreams tonight. Seems a little fishy that she seems so happy in this place. Maybe she didn't really write it. Maybe the people from the hospital wrote it. Maybe she's dead. the door I came through? Yeah, it is. Yeah, yeah, it is. Alright. I'm about to run out of batteries. This door's locked. <gasps> I know everybody saw that. I know you saw that.
What's with all these broken cameras? It's like maybe every investigator that's come here has been killed and I'm the only one who survived. <gasps> oh, oh no! What am I doing? What do I do? Did they just walk by? Do they not know where I am? I don't know what to do. I'm literally like stuck. What did I write down? I recognize the handwriting. Father Martin killed a man here. Are the lies he's talking about all the files missing from the boxes? The facts? The records? They look like government agency material. At least 30 years old. Probably older. I start thinking... McCultra CIA mind control. The buzzing won't stop. Maybe our character is going insane because he seems to be talking really weird lately. Okay, can we figure out what the heck I am doing? Okay, my objective is to still follow the blood. Um, but what do I do when there's naked men chasing me? That's a good question. It's freaking door! I really can't walk over the door. The stupid door is in my way. They put it here to sabotage me. That booty, though. Okay, I gotta come up with a plan. The arrow says go that way, but they're going that way. Is there another arrow anywhere? Really, though? <sighs> oh, okay. I don't even know if this is the way I'm supposed to be going. But I know that they're gonna come back in here. I should go close that door. Is this the way I'm supposed to be going? I'm scared. Hurry, run! Okay. Okay. We made it out alive. Barely. Okay, so if I fall down, there's the way to get up. Just so I'm... Just gotta mentally tell myself that. Alright. Going this way. Oh god. One. Let's try that again. Come on, come on, come on, get up, 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 get up. No, that did not just happen. There's somebody down there! We're gonna die! This means I can't see in the dark. I can't see in the dark. What am I gonna do? You need your camcorder to navigate the darkness. Oh no! This is so bad. This is so bad. What am I gonna do? I can't see. Please don't be them in here. Please don't be in here. Who 
was in the shower. All right, here we go. Where is the camera? This is like the scariest thing that could ever happen. That camera was my lifeline. Does anybody remember The Weakest Link? What happened to that show? That was such a good show. This is not okay. This game is too dark. <laughs> I got like goosebumps from that. Oh gosh. I'm scared. I'm real scared. Oh. Are you nice? Oh, you don't know. No, I don't think so. You don't look very nice. Is that a document? No. Come on, lightning. Show me the way. This way. Oh, this is bad. This is real bad. <laughs> there better not be a chase scene when I don't have my camera. Okay, when I pick up this camera, something bad is gonna happen. Ah! How did I know? I know this game too well. Where do I go? Gotta find a way to the third floor. I'm in the bathroom. <gasps> yes! Yes! I'm doing it! Come on. Get up, get up. <sighs> I did it. I did it. How do I get out of this bathroom? Can I move this out of the way? Oh, okay. There we go. Oh boy. That was stressful. All right. The broken camera is really frustrating me. Okay, how do we get back up here? Can I just jump? There we go. Hell yeah! We making progress! Find Father Martin in the administration block. Ooh! So close, I almost missed it. Is there a battery? No. Oh, see? That's where we were when we began. So we've made pretty much no progress. Really? This place is falling apart. It's actually making me mad. I make it? What did I do? Oh boy. Please don't hit me. 
Only one way out. Only one way. Which way? Let me know, Mr. One-Eye and No Top Lip. Where do I go? How do you know you're not a patient? That's a very good question. How do I know I'm not a patient? I probably am a patient! I've probably been here for years! I probably was a reporter. Maybe. But now, I'm an insane patient. Got the chapel, cafeteria, recreation. Oh no. Not this way. I don't want to go towards him. Close that shit. God. There's nowhere to hide in here. Really? Really? Can't see. Why do I keep doing that? I am so stupid. Uh... There we go. Ooh. Oh, that neck, though. Watch this guy still be alive. That's pretty gross. Interact. <laughs> Bye. Is that the front hall? God, get me to the front hall. Ooh, I'm nervous. Okay, uh, I, Dr. Med Rog, Rogue, I don't know. I have pressing news concerning the ongoing work of Dr. Rudolf Wernicke. In this development of the morphogenic engine, expanding on theories developed in his brief but unfortunate relationship with A. Turig, if I had not witnessed it myself, I would not believe it had happened. But beyond even the promise in cellular regeneration and guided cancer road generation. I believe Wernicke's method has breached the spiritual realm. Something crossed from the other side. I personally witnessed the appearance of an apparition briefly, but undeniably so. Please forward my note and an invitation to witness further experiments to Dietrich Eckhart. I do not doubt that the further himself may be made aware of our discoveries. It is my opinion that Dr. Wernicke's accesses represent an enormous opportunity for our cause and the German people, and are obviously sufficient reasons to keep him out of any sort of culling program. Regards to your family. Signature illegible. Okay. I'm scared. I'm real scared. Chris Walker is just gonna pop out of my butt in two minutes.
Coming. Okay, there's a key in the theater behind the thing. Why does my camera keep doing that? Who's playing that? Okay, there's a ladder. Can't get through this way. Hopefully this is going to the theater and I'm not just going the opposite direction. <sighs> Lots of lockers to hide in so this can't be good. Is he wearing a mask? Maybe I should hide? Like, now? I should watch that, but give me one second. I have a feeling like they're gonna get me. They're gonna have me watch that movie, and I'm gonna die. Subject, flesh-eating bacteria. Wash those hands regularly, winky face. I really should go back and watch that movie. Maybe I'll watch it on YouTube someday. It's too late now. Get in. What do I just go back now? Do I have to wait till the the movie's finished? Oops. Is the movie over? Project Wall Rider is a gateway. That's all I learned. Almost there! And... Jump! We made it! Ooh. Now the door's open! Let's close it. Behind the light. Oh, there it is. Find Father Martin on the third floor. Okay, so I'm gonna stop it here. Um, we just got a ton done, and hopefully we're going to meet Father Martin in the next part. 
but he is just on a huge scavenger hunt with us right now. Uh, we had to go to the laundry chute, we had to get chased by the naked guys, we had to find a key in the theater, we lost our camera. I mean, the list goes on and on. Will we ever meet him? Will we ever find out what's happening? Probably not. <laughs> I really don't know. But thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!